It took me 15 years to learn this. I'm gonna teach you in one minute. And there are not that many people on this planet that understand what I'm about to show you. It's complex, but I'm gonna make it very simple. The government needs real estate built. And because of that, they influence behaviors to put dollars in that asset class. One way they do that is by allowing investors to depreciate their asset. Let's say this camera is the apartment, since I don't have an apartment. This apartment I bought for $1.5 million, building itself is worth a million. Let's say this building pays me $5,600 a month, but I have to pay my expenses and my debt, which equals $4,000. So I'm left with $1,600 of cash flow every month, or $19,200 of cash flow annually. Now this is what the government allows you to do. They allow you to depreciate this asset over 27 and a half years. So I would take a million dollars, divide that by 27 and a half years, which would give me $36,363 to depreciate each year. When you look at my $19,200 of what would be taxable income, when I subtract it by the $36,363, I actually show a loss a loss of $17,163. So that means all of this, I don't pay taxes on. And that negative 17,000, I can actually use to offset against future income. Yeah, I mean, this is, this is huge. I think this is one of the better videos I've ever seen of someone explaining this because when you think about it, you know, you're like, oh, I'm making this much money and that, 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 that's good and great, but it's, it's the loss that you're taking that's even bigger. You know, and it's not even really truly a loss. It's just through depreciation, you're allowed to use that loss and that negative income to offset your other income. So this is, this is huge. I think this is a great video.